Good day everyone, my name is Elsie Jane Olasiman and I am a science teacher applicant for junior high school and this is my semi detailed lesson plan in science 7 with a topic of charges and different charging processes and the most essential learning competency of this topic is describing different types of charging processes so allow me to start everybody stand please lead the prayer and a name the father the son the holy spirit amen okay good morning class before you sit down please pick up the pieces of paper under your chair and make your column straight okay thank you for your attendance please save present if your name is called anna cameron very good so everyone is present good job class all right so now for your assignment people in front please collect all the papers and pass it to me okay amazing all right now before we start let's have an activity so our activity for today um it serve it will serve as a review and some of the questions are related to the topic that we are going to discuss today so please be um, observant okay class as you can see there are four balloons each balloon has corresponding question so all you need to do is to pick one balloon and answer the question so who wants to go first yes no one okay okay i'm gonna pick one and then i will have another student to answer okay i'll pick the first balloon red what do you call the positively charged particle anyone yes anna very good anna all right next who wants to go cameron all right here's your question okay what comes into your mind when you hear the word electricity yes very good cameron and who wants to go for the third one yes rita okay all right purple this is your question the basic building block for all matter in the universe is called very good rita and also one last who wants okay john what do you think are the ways to charge to acquire charge okay this is the same as heat transfer okay any yes very good all right so that's it for the activity so now before we proceed we have to be guided um with this following objective so everyone please read okay thank you so now the activity that we did um earlier talks about what okay electricity yes charging okay charging very good so today's topic is all about the types of charging processes so please um observe this picture okay what is the woman doing yes um john the woman is rubbing the balloon against her hair okay so what type of uh, charging processes um, takes place do you think what do you think yes friction very good yes it's friction correct just like heat transfer as what we did we, we've discussed last week okay so the woman is rubbing the balloon against uh, her hair so one object become or gains electrons and becomes pos negatively charged and one object loses electron and becomes positively charged so by the way what is friction please read okay very good so um take note that when we say friction it involves rubbing rubbing two objects against each other okay C very good all right so now how how do we know um if the object uh, tends to gain electrons or becomes negatively charged and what objects becomes positively charged okay so we have to consider the triboelectric series what is a triboelectric series so a triboelectric series is a list of um, materials according to their tendency to lose and gain electrons so here these objects tends to lose electrons and becomes positively charged and these objects here uh, here tends to gain electrons and become negatively charged okay so now um, next please observe what do you observe Ben okay Ben the two objects are touching each other very good observation so what type of charging processes is this what do you think okay it is like heat conduction very good so what is conduction 
Very, please read. Okay, right. So conduction involves direct contact. So now, um, look at this. The negatively charged rod is being touched to the neutral metal sphere. So what happens to the metal sphere? It becomes negatively charged. Very good. So it is because the electrons transferred to the metal sphere and it becomes um, um, ne the, uh, it has it becomes negatively charged and also take note that the conduction when we are making a conduction um, or when we are charging a conduction we are creating the same uh, charge so next please observe this um, illustration all right so Chris very good all right it doesn't involve touching the two objects are not touching each other so what do you think is the type of charging processes is this it is okay induction what is induction everyone please read very good so in this induction in induction it does not involves um, contact okay it does not involve contact so as you can see we have negatively charged rod um, when placed or when brought near to the neutral metal sphere the electrons in the metal sphere moves away and and also this part of the metal sphere becomes positively charged and it wants to attract the metal rod okay so by the way why do what do you think uh, is the reason why these electrons in the metal sphere moves away yes uh, ben yes it is because they have the same um, electron so the same electron meaning I mean the same charge negative and negative move away or repel okay always remember that so now this time we're gonna do an experiment so please um, go to your group group one group two and group three okay so in the first experiment we are going to uh, charge materials by friction so in the next um, experiment we are going to need an electroscope what is an electroscope this is an electroscope please read everyone okay good so this is just an improvised uh, electroscope so next activity is this our experiment so we are going to charge a material by conduction and induction and this is the set b so now um, before we have the written test let's review what we did today so today we did um, we discussed the different charging processes so what are those very good okay and also we had an experiment and we charge objects through okay very good all right so now and also uh, okay let's have a written test so please um, prepare a piece of paper let's start are you ready okay number one all right very good so now um, people people in front please gather all the papers and pass it to me okay very good all right so now this is your assignment okay so in this assignment okay please this distribute this all right thank you so and that's it do you have any questions about the lesson for today not so far good all right so that is it um, for today so um chris please lead the prayer for the closing in the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, thank you so much, guys. Uh, thank you so much, class, and that's all for today. Goodbye.